Hey friend, it's Yuris here and this is Tattoo Shop Talk, channel where we talk tattoo related stuff, share our experiences doing tips, tricks, reviews and whatnot and today we will talk about books for tattooing or just helpful books or books that is cool to have. We did a video a while ago about books that we have and they are pretty useful for tattoo work and since then I have a bunch of new books and I want to share them with you and why they are cool. So first bunch here would be Sailor Jerry books and that's like if you like tattoos, if you like traditional tattoos, it's a must-have thing, something from Sailor Jerry. I have Sailor Jerry Tattoo Flash Volume 1, Volume 2, Volume 3 and Sailor Jerry's Treasure Chest. So these, as they state by their name, they have Sailor Jerry Flash and it's just all the classic pieces with Sailor related stuff and all the classic bits. So it's really cool to have and it's really cool to learn from them. And even if you're tracing stuff, it's really cool stuff like this eagle on a cover. How awesome is that? There's bunch more classic pieces and and if you're one of them people who's like, yeah, but I can find it all online, you can't. It's not all of it there, and usually it's in some shitty resolution. This is the good stuff, you can see it. Look at this awesome ship! It's a really good books to have. And the first one... Look, again, classic piece. How awesome is that? And there's bigger, smaller bits, really nice flashes. With a lot of titties which is also a nice thing. And this one is treasure chest and it's a bit more different kind of paintings and whatnot. And also in this one you have those sketches of flash pieces and they're really cool to see and to figure out how it's, how it's been sketched up and, uh, and build up and all that. And it's also a lot of awesome stuff. So Sailor Jerry stuff, it's probably nothing new, but it's something can I something that I can't recommend more to have if you're at least remotely interested in traditional tattooing. Sailor Jerry, good stuff. I got these books secondhand, so I don't know where you can buy them and how much they cost new and if they are available new, but look out for them. Next one is this one and I chose it just because of cool cover and then I was like, oh, what is this? Opened it up and this is one by Jason Phillips. And I like this little bit underneath here that says all designs are intended to be duplicated as tattoos only. And there's also some traditional pieces, a bit different approach from Sailor Jerry stuff, but also a lot of cool stuff and something that seems maybe a bit weird in the beginning, but once you look into them and when you try to replicate some of them, it's really awesome stuff. And that's something that everyone should see and, and just know that those things exist. There's some cool daggers and whatnot. So really cool book. Looks really cool in background, you know. A golden skull. Really cool book by Jason Phillips. Then I have this little fun book here. I don't know if you can see it because I'm all yellow and this is also yellow. It's called Icelandic Magic for Modern Living. And it's by one and only both Conkers. If you haven't seen that guy, definitely look into him. He does all these graphic and mandala-like works and he's a hand poke artist. And from now I know that he's also a very good designer of Icelandic magic staves. And this is a very humorous book and there's all sorts of cool designs. For example, stave to improve your Wi-Fi. This with a little oink oink thing in the middle to protect you from corrupt politicians. There's all sorts of good stuff. I will not show all of them because you have to buy that book because it's awesome. And it's not too expensive. You can buy it from, I will put a link in the description where you can buy it because it's a pretty cool book. It's not too expensive and it's really funny to have. I have it on a shelf and it's fun when people grab it and they think it's, it's a serious stuff and they start to look into it and they're like, oh, this is confusing. And then they laugh because it's fun. And the last but not least is a book by Henri Straume and I always wanted it and finally I got it because I saved up enough and it was on a sale. And there's a lot of awesome lettering stuff. 
it's so awesome that it's hard to read but if you want to practice any of it this is a this is a cool reference book where to see how it's made there's all sorts of scribbles and sketches and whatnot and i'm really happy that i got it there's at the end there's a bit more crazy and bigger stuff which is unreadable for my simple brain but again if you're into this darker scary looking fonts this is good stuff where to look for references so there's a lot of lettering stuff and all sorts of shapes and sizes and details and whatnot and like my colleague pointed out when he looked at this book there's these two pages with just alphabet and he said this book is worth the money just for these two pages because you can get a lot out of it and you can learn a lot by just looking at these two types of lettering that are a bit jazzed up there's all this old english looking stuff with with a bit funk around it and all the classic letterings if you if you're not into crazy stuff just these four pages will do a lot for your little tattooing skill improvement if you learn this you already know a lot and then it's all the crazy from fun to almost unreadable stuff to stuff that looks like metal band logos and whatnot and the awesome stuff with this book is that you buy it from froststreetwear.com so when you buy this book we can, you can drop in your basket some t-shirts or whatnot because there's a lot of cool stuff on that web page check it out so this was my update on tattoo related books maybe you have some awesome books that you can't live without or you totally recommend to anyone who's into tattooing so if you have one or few drop it down in the comment section and we will try to find it and check it out and if not books maybe there's some internet pages or something where you can find some awesome stuff share that with the planet again in comment section and don't forget to subscribe press all the like buttons and all that stuff and i'll see you in the next episode Thanks for watching and have an awesome time. Bye.